Look at the colours on that. Really unusual one for Mark. And my first time doing anything like this. I will tag Mark in the video. Alright, there you go. Right, to finish off, bit of the old burnishing cream. I know a lot of people use different products, but this is just what my phone works for me. A couple of thin coats. Rub it until it's dry. All the way around. And now leave it for a few minutes just to sell. Looks great, but I'll just give that a couple of more coats. Right, that's it done. Um, laid out as normal. Um, as you can see, there's a few kits there waiting to be done. Nice mix and match there. But, uh, they're all to be done next. So, um, again, um, I'm using our, an Art Deco kit, um, which is the, uh, not sure the correct, correct pronunciation, uh, the Pro Z kit. Um, I personally like it, it's a nice Art Deco thing. Um, you'll see the old handmade pen vise there. Um, I find it easier to control. Um, so, let's assemble this, nice and simple. Before I tighten it up, I just look where's going to be the best for it. So you've got loads of I personally like that green, so I'm going to make sure that's not covered. always take me time doing this because it's really easy to uh, to mess up at the last minute so I just find taking me time is uh, that much easier doing some last minute checks as well sometimes you do get a bit of oh, where I've cleaned it off a bit of residue so be careful that doesn't come through to the pen otherwise it does spoil the effect Quite enough. There you go, all done. I have to say, quite pleased with that mark. Nice experiment that. Thank you very much. Thanks very much for watching. So that was a, an experimental blank from Mark. Um, really nice to turn as you can see. Um, 
I've speeded obviously the video up, otherwise it'd be a bit boring. <laughs> um, so yeah, really nice kit and uh, a nice finish. Um, I really enjoy doing um, different types of uh, ones. As you can see there, doing a few more today. Um, that's from the Harry Potter set. Um, is it uh, the platform nine and three quarters at King's Cross? Um, that's a lovely piece of uh, beam from the platform where it was filmed. Um, so I'm doing that one next. That's a solid wood as well, so it's going to be a nice one and lots of sharpening. Um, but it's, you know, I quite enjoy it doing the different ones and got a couple of other ones I'm doing ready for Remembrance Day and things like that. A couple of craft fairs coming up, so I'm building up for that. Thanks very much for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. It'd be great to see you. Ring the bell um, and you'll get notification. Make sure you uh, stay safe. All of my social media um, details are down the bottom. It'd be great to interact with you. Any feedback, love it. Positive or negative. Um, as I've said before, time and time again, that's how we learn. I'm not saying that's the way to do it, it's the way I do it and it seems to work. A lot of people said last time about using the burnishing cream. Um, my partner has had one that's used the burnishing cream that she's been using every day for about 18 months. Um, there's no wear and tear on it, so it obviously works. Um, so I'm going to stick with that. I really love using the Yorkshire grit, um, I have to say. Um, Got any questions please just ask have a fantastic day and thank you very much for watching i'll see you soon